Hello, how's it going? Soul Tire here with part 30 of my Roma Selectum 3 Let's Plays of Belgium. Now, previously, uh, Artos had won a couple of battles over, over here towards uh, Aginon and um, was sent, sent his army back for retraining. Get script up and running. And um, actually. Don't need any of those, but we Lord? could yes. send them back for retraining as well. Although I can't get them any queue as of yet. But uh, oh wait a minute, I could do it actually. We just take those out and put them in. Right, see how that goes. Because we've got a few spear units over here to make up uh, an army for them. <coughs> Excuse me, if there's any uh, immediacy. Uh, yes. Got a couple there as well, so we're fine. Um, now, what else do I want to do? We want to get some of these guys over as well, because they could do with Chief. Chief. armor Chief. upgrades and stuff. We don't send Order. too many to the harm the garrison in any way. Just go to watch that these um, Greeks don't decide to attack us, but. You know, we can get we can get across there if there's any problems. Anybody all oh, look bib right. Got a cavalry units there. Oh, let's have him retrained in there. <coughs> Excuse me, crikey. Real frog in my throat. Right, got a bit of a problem here. Let's drop his tax down a bit. Um now what's I doing? Oh yeah, I was building and like, putting an army Order. together here. We don't need, we're just getting these answers for garrison, no. Yeah, maybe we will. Okay, um. I think we could be doing just to protect us. We've got another couple, we'll send one over to uh, Moraz there, and then that's. At least if we get attacked, we can share their, um, their siege equipment with fire arrows. Uh, if, if needs be. We've got a rebel army here, uh, brigands that needs to be taken care of. Although not by these guys, but I don't know, we'll have to have a look at them. I'm going to get this guy here. Um, Lucalo, I think his name is. Or Lucillo. We'll try that. And we'll get him a little bit of a, an army and send them across to deal with those brigands. We want to get um, Borio's army. We want to put... I mean, he don't look much caught, really, does he? Um the other guy. He's a family member. They're both family members. Just check, check tree. Right, so they're both. He's actually a direct family member and he's an in law. Okay, he's married on to it. Right, keep an eye on that. If I can remember, of course. Um, and that's pretty much it. So let's go on to the next turn. Alright, Galasai back again. Okay. We need to look at a way of taking care of that. Damn, I've got to take that spy with the ship. Here we come, mate. Jump on, son. Right, carry on. And then we'll bring them round and they can disembark. Anywhere, really. Okay. 
Let's have a look at the news. Mm -hmm. Okay, plenty of roads opening up now for travel. Oh, a trip around the settlements to find out who's under pressure. And we're looking t to lose 12,000 on this turn. So that isn't too bright at all. Alright, let's. What have we got up here? Won't they spy? Ah, it's no point in keep ta taking them out now. He's almost dead, isn't he? Leave that on high tax, it'll be fine. They're all fine on. They're fine. They're comfortable. Um, bag of corn isn't though. Dunk. and they'll survive for now. General. There we go, it's fine. Um, get him another, get him a couple of archers. General. That's it. Just make sure in the safe situation. Arts are pretty cheap. And now we've got a good little army there. Now we've got to deal with these fellas, have we? Now and then. Um, three units of spearmen there. So, Artos. Look at this, that's not good. That's not good at all. Yes. Move. Yes. We'll move them in. March. And General. 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 Leaving the army. Uh, we all got a strong enough army there. Um we haven't got a general leading them, we get them almost a full stack, 18 units. Um, Orders. Move out. Orders. General. General. Yes. Orders. Leaving the army. Chief. Yes. General. I think we'll send there. Uh, can you get back to Gregoria? There you go. I think Chief. I'm going to. How many do I need? General. Chief. Yes. Order. Perfect. Chief. Leaving the army. That'll do it. And then you Chief. guys go back Move. in, and Move. we'll attack these guys. Attack! Fear us! Kill them! Right, now let's have a closer look at what they've got. One, two, three, four units. Cav. Couple of Ambacaros. They're wicked looking there. Light like him. Uh, Iberian Skitaris. Uh, Celtibrian Spearmen. And Scottimareva, who are pretty tough. Chav Cav, couple of axe men, not much in that's depleted. Iberian Skitari, that looks like it's depleted. They look like they're depleted, so it's fairly oh sorry. Let's quickly go back. They've all got silver upgrades and experience. <coughs> so I'm not gonna be a pushover, even though I outnumber them. And we can retrain easily enough, but it's at a cost as usual. But I want to destroy this faction and you now give me a really solid base, then we can start looking at expanding our kingdom and uh, European domination anyway. I don't know if I'll go that beyond that. That spell is the enemy. That's what fear does to weaklings. 
Shall we show them what swords can do to their skulls? Warriors, take up the sword and the axe, the bow and the knife. We come for glory and honor. Okay. Now then, is that rising ground up there? It is. Quite a number of trees about as well, so. Um, I'm trying to think of the best way to get at them. I think we've got through there. Put them like so, and then we'll bring our spear units in behind. And it'll take you just a little bit wider there as it happens. I think that's what we'll do. Okay. I don't want, I want my chieftain to be able to get out though. They've got four units of cavalry. I think there was only one of them was spear units, I think, wasn't it? Um, I think I'll keep all my cavalry together because generally work better like that and it'll come up from the high ground there I think and it's a way to do it right I'm ready to go and find out where they are uh, aha so no matter what happens, I think we're going to be fighting in amongst these trains. Speed it up a bit to get there. Um, I was looking at another YouTuber's Let's Play. Um, and um, I can't remember his name, but I had, a couple, I had a comment on there. A guy was complaining because he was narrating on his gameplay, his commentating on his gameplay didn't want to listen to the twaddle, he said he liked it, the realism of just watching a battle unfold without anybody yakking in the background. <laughs> oh well, he stays on I suppose. I thought people probably like, sort of like narration and description and stuff myself personally. I mean, I think I like to hear the guy the YouTuber describe what's going on, you know, it's just, instead of just sitting back and churning out gameplays, without really describing in that what he's doing. Seems to make sense to me. Maybe I've got it wrong. Maybe I've got the wrong idea. I don't really know. But this is how I enjoy doing it, so yeah. If anybody thinks that way it's watching my watching my let's play. Tough. Here for my, I, I do this for my enjoyment, as I said before, and other people's entertainment. If you're not entertained, well, go somewhere else and watch. I ain't gonna lose any sleep over it, I can assure you. I appreciate those that watch, don't get me wrong, but I can't make you stay and watch, you know, just because you don't like my narration or something like that. And even if you don't like my gameplay. Well, don't like it, go somewhere else. I don't mean that nasty or rude or anything, but at the same time, you know what I mean? What's the point? Don't waste your time. I'm not making any money out of this. I'm, I'm not monetized or nothing. I just do this for a hobby, something to do. Just showing off my gameplay. Well, not showing it off, but 
showing it. Sharing it. That's the word. I know I ain't the best. But I don't have any illusions about that. Killing guys take me back out of there. Hold it. Okay, back up you go. Now then, um, quite. Where's the cabra? I bet the cabra have any shifted to the flank, but I can't get at them. I don't know. What's this? Is this a missile cab? One of these. These are very much. No point in hiding now, lads. I can see you. I know where you are. <laughs> Always laughing that happens. Back you go, lads. Come on. How the friggin' hell did I lose that many? Oh, dear me. Well, I'll let my swords and throw. Happening on this side, get up in the boys. Attack there, mate, and you get up there. Take you off. Quickly, quickly! I do wish they would um, sometimes they respond a bit quicker. Come on. Guard your back, and then you can get into them. Bring you in here. Oh, look at us! Get out of all them going. They came out of nowhere. This AI is really good. This Sinuet's model of it is his sub mod. It really does does work a treat. No, oh, there you go. Much to my despair, right enough, because it seems to catch me. It seems to catch me too often. Responds quite quickly compared with most other mods. So, um, it's very good. I'm very impressed by it. Quite a lot of mods are using that um, Cinehits Pure 7 sub mod. I think it even gets used in Medieval 2 as well. Yeah, sure it does. Though I don't play it very much. I might do a let's play on it one day here. Because uh, I just downloaded um, the history and whatever it's called. True history of it, uh, stainless steel uh, HIP, uh, it's called. And uh, maybe. Oh, not the war chief, don't want the horse chief's name. How are we? Okay. Let's get you into a nice little line there. How are we doing here? Pretty much sort of hell. We don't need all those. Up there, lads. Up there, lads. Come out. They're on guard. Right. We can bring these two units in here very quickly. And you can attack them. How are we doing? Oh, get out of there. Please, Jesus. 
and you take your eyes off the map for a second and it gets you. I'm sure it recognises when you move cameras so. Alright, let's go get them. Up there. Okay, up we go and get them lads. Come across. And you come across and yeah. you get them. Need some help, I think, actually. What's happening here? Pure ball iron man. Amber Caro. Take him off guard and then you go, Lance. Come up to his gap here. Where's my archers? I ah, will send them home. Out of harm's way. Now where's that cavalry unit? With that cut general in it. Up we come lads, up here. We've got this one, I'm pretty certain. Come on general, why did they stop running there? I'm going to have to treat myself to a new keypad, I think, for Christmas. I'm sure that's what's happening. It's just, it's missing sometimes. I mean, the whole key itself is a toggle, on and off. Maybe I, I sometimes forget to do that, I know, but... So you can get them before they escape. We'll bring you guys back over here. I think the battle's pretty much won. Um, we've killed 70%, it's not enough, we need more. Oh, is he going to chase them? No, come back, come back. Can't be asked. Chasing bloody missile cab all over the place. Try and trap him. Wait till he gets past halfway. Look at this. Look at him. Get back. Alright, hope, oh, General. Stay where you are. Got him there, I think. Oh, you bugger. <laughs> Oh, I want him. he's only a captain, isn't he? So what are we worried about? Come on, keep coming this way. Keep coming this way. And you keep coming over there. Who's this? Heavy spears. You go and help down there. It's distracting me away. Come on. Just respond, will you? Come on. Slows a week in the fucking jail, so it is. Right. Slows a week in the Sahara Desert without a drink. Get in there the and kill him. Excuse Slain the French. By your brave warriors. <laughs> it's so frustrating. Right, get up here. They're done. Anybody else? Ah, oh, might as well send the cavalry in as well. There we are, they're done. Let 
general go and get some uh, kills on his kill notches on his bed uh, on his belt on his bed that's the wrong sort of notches oh what happened there he ran into trouble you still got a unit in there that's not routed have them mate Get him some. Okay, we're at eighty-seven percent. That's it. They won't be coming by. That's a battle win. This is a hunt. No, a coward chase. Okay. Can't see anything else. Victory is the reward of warriors. Great victories like this go on. So I lost just over 500 men there. Goodness. Yeah, a little bit more than what I'd like, but um, like I say, they were all we silver chevrons of experience, so the resistance is always greater. Yes. So do we take them back to Gargova and then be retrained again? How uh, much money have I got? Okay, let's get these guys done. That's all the money spent. Oh Jesus Christ, look at it, just sprout them out the ground, look. <laughs> oh not one but two. Goodness me. Right, see who's all retrained here. Lord. Okay. Orders, orders, chief, orders, yes, orders, Seven. orders, leaving the army. March! General, yes, orders, yes. Move out! Orders, orders, chief. Leaving the army. Move out. Orders, move out. General, march. General, forward. There we are. Get them retrained. I don't think they'll attack. Greek city states in the boy. Or the boy. Macedon and Rome. Carthage and Greek city broke their alliance. Okay. More roads. Oh. I certainly went to my road building. Um, what's it, didn't I? Um, scenario, get as many done as you can. Lord. Okay, we'll take him in a minute. Oh, there's another one there, look. Oh, jeez. Oh. <laughs> ah, well. That means there can't be too many here, either. Okay, mate. 
Okay, I'm going to kill him. Right, we won't dis we won't disembark him there just yet. Right, what's what have we got here? Now he hasn't got really strong enough force there. What have they got? Three units. General Well, I'm pretty much right we ought to take them out, alright. But we'll take Yes. Alright, let's go get them then. Lord. Lord. Move out. Yes. We'll take you along just for good measure. Because again, silver chevrons and, and full units, they're not going to be a pushover. But we've got plenty of missiles. Full of missiles, every unit, and three cavalry units. So you would think this would be pretty straightforward, wouldn't you? Well, you're right; it will be. But as with very hard battle, you do take casualties no matter what. I'm sure those of you who play the game will know. And of course, <laughs> I mean, unless you're much better. Um, General and I am. I'm not the greatest tactician in the world. Even now, fear works in the bowels of our foes. Scream your battle cries, call to the gods, ask for their strength, and put true fear in the souls of your enemies. All right, that will do it. I don't know if they're going to be high up when that, that top ground there I would think is pretty favourite. So we'll move up so we're coming at level with them at least. And um, uh, let me think now. Definitely fire at will. And then you three will be in there and slingers, which can fire at range. And I think that'll pretty much do it. Spread them a bit more. Alright, they're up on that hill, alright, so we'll just uh, attack from here. Get over here. Another one of them things that uh, you find a bit irritating at times about it. I mean, I mean, great mod, yes, yeah, fantastic. Everything about it is brilliant, really. Except that's quite good, isn't it? Except for the distance it seems to that, that puts between two armies, and the length of time it takes you to get to face them up, which is fine if you're just playing campaigns. But when you're doing a let's play, that's when it's, it's a pain in the ass because you got to get them there as quickly as possible, and because of your recording time. But nearly every battle is always seems to be quite a big distance between the two factions, the two forces. It's just a case of being patient. I mean, I've got it on six times speed, so... I mean, I've seen some some YouTubers fight the battles at 16 speed, you know, not just like the mop up at the end like I do or the, the fast movement to get to face your enemy. 
Does people actually find them? Great, I find it difficult enough to find them at normal pace. Fight the battles at normal pace. <laughs> but then, um, I'm an old git. <laughs> Ain't some teenager. One of these youngsters as fast as them. Hmm. Are they chucking at us? They can't be too far away. Even with high ground. Ah, miles away. We seem to uh, let's put him on skirmish mode. Can you reach him already? We're on the wrong side, really. Let's get you down here. She fired to the left of him. Their general, their captain's not a cavalry unit, so should be able to run faster than them. So sorted, get so sorted. There's no hurry. Yeah, the next battle can uh, wait for the time being. Let's see if we can get them from there. And we'll move you forward. Move you more to the left here, I think. I've noticed if you, if you keep your units of um, slingers and archers in too deep a block, you tend to kill your own men. Now, if that general unit is going to come close enough, I'll either come to us face on. Here, come on, lads, and he's gone. Sling us to stop before we kill any more of our own men. Now his men show fear. Now they may turn and run. Attack! Attack! The enemy flee from the field like frightened goats. Hunt them down and slay them all. Hey, there we go. Job done. Oh, 
Ryan. Kill your own man, you donkey. Come on, shut these muppets out. Come on, get them. Kill them off, lads. Get it done. Behind. Behind them. There you go. Find him again, cheese him. This is a great victory. The cries of dying enemies are sweet. Fifty two men. Oh dear. Right then, well, like I say, no matter what you do, you always take casualties when you get playing on very hard button, they've got silver chevrons. So, good for Maritalos, uh, we'll send your men back in the there, and Artos, well you need to wait for the next part for that, uh, so thanks for watching and um, come back and watch this battle, bye.